welcome to our channel in this session we will discuss one pattern matching algorithm that is kmp algorithm what is the main purpose of this pattern matching algorithm they are given a text and a pattern our aim is you need to identify whether this pattern is available in the text or not suppose if this pattern is available we are returning the index that is the position of the pattern in the text now for this kmp algorithm the procedure is very simple instead of brute force approach the kmp algorithm construct an lps table for the pattern based on the lps table it performs a comparison we already discussed the kmp algorithm with one example now in this session we are directly moving to the example now construct the lps table how do we construct simply first the letter is a till now a is not repeated the value zero b b is not repeated value zero a a already appeared the value of a is one now b is also appeared and observe here b followed by a already b is followed by a so b count is 2 suppose assume here in place of c if i have a what is the value observe a is already appeared the value is 3 but now here we have c till now c is not repeated 0 this is lps table or else we are using some predefined algorithm or a common prefix suffix method you can use any of the way for calculating lps table here directly i construct now come to our point comparison here i am using two pointers one is i for text moving and another pointer j for pattern moving do the comparison first two i and j that is a and a both are equal if both are equal i am moving to this one j moves to here right in the next step b and b same if there is a match move i move to here j move to here now a and a again there is a match if there is a match increment the pointer now i is at this position j is at this position now b and b again there is a match now i is at this position j is at this position now here the value is a here the value is c mismatch occurred that is the concept whenever mismatch occur in regular brute force algorithm we are blindly start the search from this position again same process but here whenever mismatch occurred we are using the lps table now what are the indexes 0 1 2 3 4 now whenever mismatch occurred what is the value of j the value of j is equal to 4 if mismatch occur j value is updated to lps of j minus 1 this is the only thing you remember whenever mismatch occur and if the value of j is greater than 0 now j is updated to lps of 4 minus 1 3 now j is equal to 0 1 2 3 4 what is lps of 3 the value 2 now j value is 2 immediately j moves to the position 2 you got it this is the main thing again i am repeating whenever mismatch occur we are updating the j value according to the lps table now j is updated now j moves to here we are doing our search operation from this position same concept now a is compared with a i is at a fixed position against matching now this is i value this is j value now b is compared with b matching now this is i value and this is j value c is compared with c here again matching 
right now we are here this is j i and j again there is a matching so i is points to this position j is ended that means my complete pattern is available my complete pattern is available observe a b a b c a b a b c my complete pattern is available in which position my pattern is available it is very simple concept so simply 6 minus 4 or else if you want if you are incremented 7 minus 5 whatever it is i minus j 6 minus 4 value is 2 so my pattern is available from position 2 right or wrong this is the concept of KMP algorithm. Anyway, if you want, if you want to check how many number of times the pattern is repeated, you can do the same procedure. That means right now, I points to here. Again, J starts from 0. Observe this one. A, A matching, B, B matching, A, A matching, B, B matching and C, C matching. That means my pattern is available at position number 7 also. That means in this test my pattern is available at 2 positions. This is the way to implement KMP algorithm. In the next session we will discuss one more example for the KMP algorithm. Thank you.